He says here, I'm coming quickly. Church, we don't have time to play. I used to get in trouble past the hall because they made us go to church. And we didn't have the best toys in the world. But me and my cousins, I would, I would take an old box, stand it up on this side, and that was my pulpit. My cousins would be on the step, and that was the morning, bitch. And we'd have church. Grandma would look out the window and say, y'all better stop playing church. And I tell you, but I ain't mean to hurt nobody's feeling, but there are some folk in the world playing with church. If you don't believe the Lord is coming back, look at all these storms that are happening. If you don't believe the Lord is coming back, look how we're killing one another. If you don't believe the Lord is coming back, look at all the pastors getting in trouble. If you don't believe God is coming back, then look outside your window. It's been hot, but it ain't never been this hot. Yeah. Is that a funeral? A couple of weeks ago and I uh, change into my shirt, trying to get my jacket on to go out to the cemetery. The deacons, they laugh about it, they didn't cut down the trees at the cemetery. And that son whooped me like I stole something. <laughs> Just walking yeah. out to the gravesite. Yeah. And when I, when I finally got to the gravesite, y'all, behind me, there was a sister behind the shed like this. I said, baby, what you doing? There ain't no shade with me, ain't no shade. When I finally got to the tent, they said, Reverend, what took you so long? I said, well, <laughs> as hot as it is, I want to make sure none of y'all go to hell, so if hell is hotter than this, I ought to see you all on Sunday morning. He says, I'm coming quickly. The word quickly should be taken as soon and without warning. In the meantime, they should hold on to what they have. Don't forget how good God has been to you. Don't forget how he wakes you up. Don't forget that when trouble comes in your life, it's there just to make us stronger. For he says in his word, that our reward would be a crown, referring to a wreath rewarded to the winner's athletic contest. We just finished watching, just finished watching the Olympics. And they even, they gave those medals. But I'm not looking for a medal. I'm looking for my crown. Anybody here looking for the crown? The only way you can get a crown, you got to run your race. You can't run my race. I can't run yours. But whatever you do, you can't let nobody steal your blessing. Understand, understand that one day, yeah. if we keep on trusting in the Lord, yeah. he has a reward for us. Yeah. But while we're down here, we are going to have to go through some heartache and pain. Am I right about a church? Well, when eagles want to get their eaglets to the next level. See, church, what they do is they stir the nest. Eagles put broken twigs in the nest. So that the babies, yeah, begin to grow and rest on them. After a while, and by and by, they become a, a little irritated. Then uh, the eagles stir the nest and put grassy stuff 
just want to meet you. Bringing the needles of straw to the top. That when the eagle tries to sit down, after a while, the eagle has to move. Am I right about a church? And after a while, brothers and sisters, the eagle gets irritated because it can no longer sit in the nest. Am I right about a church? And only after the eagle gets irritated, yes, does it use his wings. Am I right about it, church? If the eagle never gets irritated, then it'll never use his wings. I began to look at the eagle, yeah, and I saw you and me. I began to look at the eagle, and I began to see God. If the Lord doesn't stir up some mess in our lives every now and again, we'll never learn how to fly. I'm glad today. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad for my struggle. Yeah, because my struggle made me stronger. Is there anybody here whose struggle has made them stronger? Is there anybody here that knows that they had not been for being lied on? If they had not been for being talked about? If I had not been Thank you. 